Time is an unstoppable force of nature. As it marches onward, everything in the known universe grows older. This fact is also true in Equestria. Now this is a topic that has been widely and rigorously debated for decades to the point of exhaustion, frustration, and in some cases utter confusion. Let us see if we can shed some light on this topic by posing this pointed question. What is a pony's age? We will not be using Merriam-Webster this time, because the definition should have been covered in your previous class. Now what's that? They, they told you it would be covered in this class? <sighs> this education system, I swear to god. Nevertheless, in order to not reinvent the wheel, let's do some preliminary groundwork on the subject. Let's focus on the main six. If we were to look up their age... What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? So that was a bust. To no one's surprise, it'll be near impossible to pinpoint the actual age of one of these equines, especially since it's implied time progresses in the show, and thus they keep aging. It appears Heisenberg's uncertainty principle applies here, but instead of momentum, it's age. Wait, did we just imply that ponies are subatomic particles? Let's try another method. We can approximate an age range based on professions of each of the ponies in Season 1. Twilight Sparkle can be estimated to be the age of a university student, undergraduate specifically. I went to college! I say undergraduate and not graduate because she still actually has a passion for what she's learning about and still cares about turning assignments in on time. <laughs> As a result, 18 to 22. Assuming Applejack is American, and why would we assume otherwise, just forget to look at her. She has to be at least 21 to own a liquor license, sell, distribute, and serve cider. On the other end of the spectrum, the oldest licensed distillery of Applejack in the USA was founded in 1780. So she's somewhere between 21 and 230 years old. Yep. You're kidding, right? Rainbow Dash drinks like a fucking monster, so she's at least 21. The maximum age to join the Wonderbolts as a cadet, using the same constraints that the US Air Force uses, is 39. Now taking into account that- Boy, she fast as fuck! According to a study conducted by the Sports Performance Research Institution, female athletes hit their peak around the age of 25. So it's safe to assume she's between 21 and 25. Rarity owns her own business, and it's implied she's been running it successfully for a few years. In terms of age, it's likely that she's on the older end of the main six since she owns her own property and enterprise that she did not inherit from her parents. Plus, by season six, she's got two additional branches under her brand. I'm pretty sure Rarity is a textbook definition of a girl boss. Putting all that aside, according to Zipia, the average age of a fashion designer is 36.6. But also, Rarity is basically Audrey Hepburn as a horse, and she rose to stardom at the age of 24. So let's put Posh Spice between the ages of 24 and 36. Medical science can shed some light on Pinkie Pie here. This horse is another alcohol drinker, so at least 21. But based on how much junk food she consumes, this chick is at peak metabolism, which women's health states occurs in the late teens or early 20s. Bing bang boom, she's around 21 to 25, same as Rainbow Dash. Hi! Next, Fluttershy, how do you make money? I don't know. Do ponies pay you for taking care of animals? You're not a vet, so are you some kind of homeopathic healer or something? Ah, fuck it. You're canonically one year older than Ponk, so 22 to 26. There, done. <gasps> Finally, Starlight Glimmer. Is there a minimum age for starting a cult? Nah, I don't think so. She seems to have been practicing magic for longer than Twilight, which would put her older than the main six. But we know she ran into Mod Pie, who completed her doctorate. Doctorate! Oh, whatever. Which would put her around age 29 when the two met for a second time. Starlight, being roughly around the same age, would have started the village while Mod was working on her dissertation. Theoretically, Starlight could be between 24 to 29 in her first appearance in season 5. Now, these are all human equivalent ages. For horses, these numbers are drastically different. I'm sure everyone is familiar with the concept of a dog year. If we were to do a quick mathematical conversion to find the ratio of pony years to human years, these ponies are somewhere between 3 to 6 years old at the time of first appearance. Thankfully, we can verify all of this estimation and approximation, since we have the word of God to rely on. In an excerpt from the Faustacorn herself, she says exactly as we concluded. 
Another victory for the scientific process. Huzzah and congratulations all around. Oh, except there's one minute detail we've overlooked. One more thing. All the characters that we mentioned, sans Starlight, debuted in 2010. So as of 2023, they're all 13 years old. And Starlight is eight. It just don't add up! But even more technically technically, technically, also in the words of God, who fucking cares? It doesn't matter. There you go. What's a pony's age? Inconsequential and arbitrary. The thesis was pointless. Doctorate denied. Now get out.